Hello, I'm Daniel, and welcome to the Moon Project. We here at the Moon Project are continuing in our series of videos with respect to inspiration, guidance, and advice. And uh, I remember reading recently that the uh, one of the sources, one of the roots of Lashon Hara, malicious gossip, is arrogance, a person's uh, uh, sense of superiority, their uh, sense that they're somehow better some than someone else, and they're going to uh, spread... Uh, uh, malicious uh, gossip about this person. Why? Because they're such a, they're so great, and they can, uh, they figure they can look down uh, on a person and feel badly about them, and and, and and sorry, and speak badly about them. And this era, and, and thinking about this arrogance, I'm reminded of the, uh, uh, of this image I was, uh, uh, I once uh, heard. Uh, there was a donkey. Uh, not the brightest animal in the world, and this particular donkey was very haughty, very, uh, very prideful. He was just thought the world of himself. And um, being a donkey, he's a beast of burden, and he would uh, have to carry loads in and out of the village. One day he would carry a, a load of uh, spices and perfumes, and he noticed that when he was going into town. Uh, people drew near to him, and they were pleased, they were happy, they were smiling, and they were... And he thought, see, I'm, see look how loved I am, look how much people admire me, I'm so wonderful. The next day, he's carrying a load into town, and it's not nearly as pleasant. He's, he's uh, carrying fertilizer, very foul, evil-smelling stuff. He goes into the village, and people are keeping very far away from him, and, you know, with not very happy looks on their faces. And he's going back, and he gets back to the stable, and he's bragging to the other animals. He says, you know what? I tell you, you know, the other day I was coming into town, and people liked me and admired me, and they were coming up to me, and that was wonderful. This time I came into town, and they feared me, they respected me, they kept away, they kept their distance, no one said anything, nobody smiled, nobody. There was a fox in the stable, listening to this. And he uh, said to the donkey, you know, you really are a donkey. It's not you. It's what you carry around with you, what you give off. When you give off a pleasant, when your load, uh, when the, the, the stuff you're carrying gives off a pleasant uh, smell, a pleasant feeling, people respond accordingly. When the stuff you're carrying around with you is foul and evil smelling and unpleasant, people act accordingly. You yourself are nothing. It's the stuff you carry. We can use this story uh, as an insight into human nature. Uh, a lot of times we figure, oh, well, you know, I'm this, I'm that. When in actual fact, it's not so much us. It's all the baggage and all the stuff we carry with us. If we're unpleasant, if we're rude, if we spread Lush and Hara, and uh, if we uh, denigrate people, if, we, if we're not pleasant, don't be surprised when the people around you mirror that and react accordingly. Similarly, if you greet people with a cheerful face, if you judge people favorably, if you speak kindly to people, if, if uh, you encourage people, chances are people are going to respond to you in kind. It's what you do that matters. It's not what goes on in your head. It's how you translate that into action. Keep this in mind, both with respect to arrogance, how to behave, general derecheretz, politeness and manners, and lush and horror. They're all tied into each other, how we act, how we deal with people. Yiddishkeit, Judaism, following the word of God, doing what God expects of us. It's not just a theology. It is a way of life. Let it transform you into a different person. Act the way that God expects you to act. Be the kind of person that God expects you to be. Your world, your world will change, believe me. 
Uh, we're going to be doing more videos along this line. Please come back. Please watch. Please learn. And until next time, on behalf of the Immuno Project, I'm Daniil, and thank you too much.